Hey, we had a shot. We didn't. We didn't show it. I think Rich and I were looking at it in between innings uh, the other day of the uh, hidden ball trick oh. that you pulled off. Because <laughs> <laughs> it, it fooled everybody. You did it twice, didn't you? You know, I get credit for doing it a second time, but I think we were in Toronto and someone slid, and you know, one of those little pop-up slides, and I kept my glove on it. Now this. This, is this was a true one. Yes. yes. And th so tell us what happened okay, because okay, we this, missed. It. This goes a little back because the guy on second, Luis Torero, was a good prospect, but kind of like a little showy, and you know, and right there, I remember Todd Jones is behind home plate, so I just kind of walked over and I noticed that the third base coach and and the runner were just looking down. So I said, well, I'm going to wait till Jonesy gets to the mound. I was just hoping that he knew the rule because I was like, man. I don't want him to step on the mound and then I look like the idiot trying to do something. And I didn't say anything to Terrell. It's not like I said, hey, you know, what kind of shoes are those or anything like that? You know, I was just quiet. I didn't say a word. And Jonesy starts walking around and two things happened that actually made it work out. Ed Rapperano was a third base umpire. And when I showed him, I flashed my glove at him. So he knew. He knew and he, he nodded to me saying, like, I know you got the ball. So I was like, okay. And then when Jonesy starts walking back, he starts stretching. I don't think Todd Jones stretched all year, but right there he starts touching his toes, all this. I was like, ah, there's about three seconds left. Here. So sure enough, he steps off. I tag him. So I go in the dugout. I said, Jonesy, what were you going to do next? He goes, I think I was going to start doing cartwheels or something to get his attention. So it wasn't planned, but it was just, I don't know, the circumstance just played. I never really thought about doing it, but it was more of that Todd Jones was so far behind home plate that I didn't want to throw it from, you know, uh, third base to him. And I was just going to wait for him to go up and things just, it kind of panned out, so uh, I guess I'll take it.